Well, good morning, America. This is Jim Bob from Jim Bob's Commentary Channel. Coming to you from a secret location somewhere in America. Well, I've been thinking about the upcoming presidential election in 2016, and uh, I've been uh, watching a little bit on the TV about the uh, upcoming debate between uh, Hillary and Bernie and them other two, whoever they are, and Donald Trump, he's still up ahead in the polls, and Ben Carson is a little bit behind him, and uh, uh, Carly Carrion, or whatever her name is, she's the, I think she's still number three or whatever. And uh, I've been thinking that it's interesting to me about how American perceives uh, the President of the United States of America. You see, uh, he's a uh, commander in the chief and the head executive and uh, this, that, and the other. And uh, uh, it's funny to me, well it ain't funny a bit, uh, it's interesting to me uh, how these people get elected. It seems to me like uh, the more they promise you, the more you go to vote for them. You don't really even care whether they can do it or not. Uh, well, I should say you, I mean us. Uh, we, we're not so much interested in... Uh, uh, we, we just believe they'll do what they want to. It's just like a bunch of uh, car salesmen up there. Uh, they say, uh, trust me, I'm going to go in there and I'm going to fix this and that and the other. And uh, and if it's what we like, we say, oh yeah, that's the one I'm going to vote for. Uh, he's going to not, they, they can't take my guns away if he gets in there. Or uh, they'll send my kid to college if he goes in there or she goes in there. and uh, Or he or whichever and uh, that kind of stuff. Or uh, they'll... They won't raise my taxes up if that one gets in there and this, that, and the other. And uh, and at the end of the day, they ain't none of them can really do all that much when you're the president. You see, Congress and the Senate's the ones that really get the stuff done. Them jokers over there, and it's the same thing when they're running. I mean, they just promise the moon, and uh, they they can't do half of what they say they can. They could do a little piece of it. It's like Obamacare. Obama run on the uh, health care thing, and uh, he went in there and he got uh, he got his health care thing done on account of the you know the American voters uh, debated it, and so he got it run through, and it's a piece of crap. It ain't no good, um, and all the Republicans can do is try to get rid of it instead of try to fix it. So uh, you know uh, they're all a bunch of liars. That's, uh, I wasn't going to say that, but uh, the, the matter of the truth is uh, politicians are a bunch of damn liars. I mean, they're going to get up there and they're going to promise you to move and you're going to vote for them and, uh, and you're going to find out that uh, they can't do half of what they say they are. So, America, wake up. You better start uh, paying attention to these car say I mean the politicians that are out there up there telling you that they're going to do this that and the other and uh, they ain't got no real proof they can do anything so it's coming time for the next president of the United States and it'll be time soon for the next senator and uh, and uh, uh, congressman in your district and you better start finding out really a little bit more about them. Uh, and somebody better start changing the way things are done up there in Washington. Or this country's going to have some more problems than it does right now. I don't mean to be a doomsday doomer. Because uh, I don't believe the doomsday is really coming. If it does, I'm going to get me a new car in the house. But anyway, uh, I believe that... Uh, uh, we got to change the way these politicians think and the way they get uh, elected. So uh, don't be buying no uh, new cars or used cars from these presidential election people. Uh, you'll end up losing out. Now, that's my commentary for today. And so uh, Jim Bob's going to be out.